What's going on guys? I know it's been a while since you've heard from me. I've kind of been getting over um, a bunch of different sicknesses. I've been going through uh, for the last month, month and a half. We'll probably make a video about that going forward and a whole nother video. But um, I'm back with a review. Uh, a review of a product that I knew was coming out that I didn't know how I was going to feel about it, but I knew I had to grab it and I knew I had to try it. Um, and that is Coca-Cola with coffee. This is the zero sugar vanilla uh, variety, only because I wasn't really able to find the other varieties. There's, I think, a caramel one and like a straight black coffee one that also comes in zero sugar and like, I guess, which sugar for each of the varieties. There's like a, like a Coke Zero uh, variant of each of them. Now, this was very intriguing to me, only because I don't know how this is gonna taste. Flashback a little bit, um, back in, I think the Mid-2000s, Coca-Cola did come out with a product called Coca-Cola Black, which was a coffee-infused Coca-Cola beverage. And I'm wondering if this is basically the same thing along those lines um, and, you know, trying to just recapture that type of feeling. Um, I'm okay with having the vanilla variety here because I love vanilla Coke, and I do tend to like French vanilla coffee. So I do also drink my coffee usually black. It's the flavor, it's the coffee, it's this and that. I don't add sugar, I don't add milk. Um, so I'm very intrigued to see what this is gonna taste like. Now these come in 12 fluid ounce cans. I was able to track this one down at a shop right near me. Uh, they're supposed to be going like nationwide. I know Walmart has like a, a big selection of them, um, at least allocated in the store by me, but there was none on the shelves when I went. So I don't know if these are that good, but they're flying off shelf everywhere um, or you know they're just not stocking them well now let's look at the uh, the whole you know nutritional facts like I always do only because this one is kind of probably gonna taste really diet soda eat uh, it's zero calories zero sugar 40 milligrams of sodium um, when we look at the ingredients it's 69 milligrams of caffeine which is fine uh, it says carbonated water, then less than 2% of coffee powder. So it's probably gonna be using like an instant coffee powder. Then natural flavors, caffeine, sucralose, which is gonna be an artificial sweetener, caramel color, phosphoric acid, asulfame, potassium, sodium benazite, and potassium sorbate. Um, now I think it's weird that they're trying to market this as Coca-Cola with coffee, but it's only less than 2% of coffee powder. And the majority of this is carbonated water. Um, so this is going to be interesting. I really hope it just doesn't taste like Diet Coke and there's like no real coffee flavor to it because I think that would defeat the purpose. Um, I am going to want to try to track down like a regular variety of it going forward. Um, but, you know, let's, let's crack this open. Offhand, it smells like Coke Zero. Um, I'm not getting any actual like uh, coffee hints coming off of it. I hope that changes when I drink it um, because I don't really want this to be a disappointment of like a, a product. I want this to be interesting. I want this to be different. And um, I guess we'll try it out. Okay, you taste coffee. Um, Oddly enough, this is really good, um, especially for like a zero sugar variant of it. It tastes like vanilla Coke, but you get those dark, bold coffee flavor tones to it, and I'm actually really liking it. Because I know Coca-Cola Black really didn't sell well when it first came out, and maybe this is like a really reworked formula where it has like nothing to do with the original, but like, this is good. I like this. Uh, I like the boldness that it gives from the coffee flavor. Um, I like just really everything about it. The vanilla matches with the Coke and the coffee grid. It almost acts as a good mediator, I think, between the two. Um, and I think this is gonna be worth checking out. I really hope this sticks around. I hope this sells well. I'm going to want to check out the other flavors, um, and with 69 milligrams of caffeine, it's not really high on the caffeine scale, but it's definitely going to give you that little kick that you're going to probably need, 
you know, the only really weird thing about this is if someone drinks this, and this is personal preference, but if someone drinks this in replacement to a uh, morning coffee, I think that would be a little weird because I'm not a soda for breakfast type of person. I don't think there's anything wrong with that, but it's just not my forte. Um, but yeah, guys, check this out. This is actually a really surprising but interesting and good product. I think you guys are going to be pleasantly surprised with it as well. As always, thank you for watching, guys. I hope you're staying safe out there. I'll catch you later. Check out Coca-Cola with coffee. Let me know what varieties you've had, um, what you think of it, do you like it, and I guess we'll go from there. Have a good one, guys. Stay safe. See you. Bye.